This is Colton with Build Brothers Roofing and Solar doing a digital roof inspection here for a realtor um, out in Poway. Um, we're doing a home here. Uh, home was built under my research in 2002. Um, looks to be the original roof. It's a flat concrete tile as we see here. Uh, additionally, uh, the tile actually lasts forever it's really, itself, really, as long as it's not cracked or people aren't walking on it or anything, but it's actually the underlayment that goes. Um, typically, on these counter flashings, we have an issue over the garage right here where we actually see the counter flashing right here and tiles uh, supposed to be nailed in underneath, but sometimes they slip up and slip down. And so it gives us a good indication of what that what that underlayment looks like. So what you can see right here is a little bit of black mastics. Somebody tried to actually, the nails uh, broke from right here, but the black mastic uh, was used to try and keep it in place. But if I get over and show with the sun, we can see the condition of that underlayment. Um, it does look weathered. It does look a little bit old. Uh, you know, the underlayment itself is a 15 year product. After that 15 years, um, it starts to degrade like we see here. Um, there's definitely signs of water intrusion and stuff like that. Um, this can be a leak point once water kind of collects and then it goes through and seeps through to the wood and then underneath into the attic space or the garage in this case. Um, slip tiles are definitely something that you want to repair when you can. Uh, we can see another one right here. We can actually see that black tar paper and the uh, condition that it's in. Um, it is squishy. Um, I would say that there has been some water that has gone in here. I wouldn't be surprised if there was a leak in this section, but uh, it's important to actually get these re, um, you know, cinched up underneath this counter flashing uh, because then, you know, then once the water hits the wall, it'll go to the counter flashing and actually flush down off into the gutter here. Uh, but yeah, uh, a little worrisome area right here. Um, underlayment. Is getting kind of towards the end of its life expectancy uh, as expected with the home built in 2002. Uh, if there was a, a roofing repair that was going to be done here on this section, um, it would actually be where we lift up the tiles, redo the underlayment and any damaged wood, and then put the same tiles back and re-nail them. Uh, I'll go ahead and give this uh, video to the realtor. Thank you.